All right, good Saturday morning, everyone. Uh, I'm coming out today with the uh, V&M Straight Wild Worm for uh, it's the third item up from the bottom. I just got it on a jig head, I'm gonna shaky head it up. And uh, we'll see how it produces. You know, I'm not feeling it. I'm not feeling it. I'm gonna go somewhere else. Spot number two. There's somebody here. Fuck. So I'll get out. All right, I'm done with this spot. We're gonna go oh, to kind of the first spot that I wanted to go to this morning. I don't know why I do that. I kind of I pick a spot and then I gotta go somewhere else. But anyway, so we'll reset. My God, look at the size of this thing. That's a fish. And he must have let it go. Can you see this? Can you see the size of this carp? This thing's huge. Oh, I am on a fish. Hang on. Okay. That was a hook set. But he's got me wrapped up around. I don't even know what. Oh man. Oh god, I can't get down there. I'm out. Okay. So what just happened is my grip fell into the thing and I had to get it <clears throat> so I did
All right, it's time to head back home. There may or may not be another stop. I doubt it. But, um, got nothing this morning. About three hours in it, I got, I mean, not even a bite. So, pretty frustrating. I'm not gonna blame the lure. Because I'm not really seeing any fish anyway, so. I don't know. We'll take it out again another day. Or maybe later on today. See if maybe there's an evening bite. But we'll catch up. Okay, so I'm out on the golf course. Um, what is it? Wednesday evening. And uh, I got about 30 minutes. But I wanted to knock out this. I can't even remember what it's called, but it's, it's on the video. Um, still got it on the shaky head, but I did switch over to a lighter setup. This is uh, Abu Vengeance Medium Light. I've got uh, the new Silver Max spinning reel and a six pound fluorocarbon. It was actually on clearance at Walmart, the Seagar Red Label for three bucks. So I picked that up and uh, it's been raining all day today. Like it just stopped maybe 30 minutes ago. So it's 5.30 so the golf course should be closed anyway but i can't imagine anybody's gonna be out here because it was it was pouring all day but uh hopefully i get on a couple here Yeesh. That's a fish on. And he's off. Crap. That's a fish. That's a fish. Set the hook and he's on. I hope. Feels like he's on. As long as he doesn't Oh yeah, big jump. Another big jump. He's on for sure. <clears throat> That's a good size fish. Oh, pulling that drag. Yeah, and I'm on six pound fluoro here. So I don't want to go crazy with him. Let him tire himself out. Wanna drag him in. Coming up again. It's just pulling it. It's fighting good. This is a good fish, y'all. It's a good fish. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I hope I'm not blocking that with my arm. He's getting tired. Here he comes. Here he comes. Oh yeah, that is a good fish, yo. What? What? <laughs> yo. Y'all got that? That is a slob. That's a pig. <laughs> Oh man. 
I love fishing here. Got uh, 19 inches. We got a weight on them. Got them in the throat. My worm is gone. Oh, crap, my worm is gone. Let's see how much you weigh, buddy. Kilograms. Oh, come on. Hello. I'll get you. I'm getting there. Okay. 215. Two pounds, 15 ounces. On that mystery tackle box worm. Slobbish. He swims. I'm back here. Just got about 10 more minutes. See if we can't get us another one. Oh, there we go. There we go. Fuck. Well, <clears throat> um, Okay, so that's that. <laughs> what do I have to say? <clears throat> I think that uh, that VNM straight worm, I think that's what it was called, VNM VNM baits, wild thing, straight worm, something like that. Anyway. Uh, seems like a pretty good uh, bite getter. Um, <clears throat> this was the second day I came out with it. First day I got absolutely nothing, nothing. Um, but then I didn't see very many fish that day. I I think I was just, I don't know, it was just a bad day for fishing in general, it seemed like. Um, but yeah, today, like I said, it rained all day. I think I was going to get bites on anything I would have thrown. Um, but yeah, that was four bites. The first one, uh, I set the hook on nothing or I set the hook, had him for a second and he came off. So I figured I just didn't let him take long enough. The second one, I stuck him, uh, if I remember correctly, two, two fifteen. So nice little pig. Um, third one was right over here and I don't even remember what happened and then that last one broke me off I set the hook he stopped and then I wasn't sure I went to set the hook again and I was off so I'm guessing I'm guessing that that had to have been a snakehead the way he just kind of stopped um you know I, I went to set the hook and he didn't run he just kind of said I'm staying put um, and then I said again and it was off so I don't know never know 
maybe Snakehead, maybe Baz, and he just got me wrapped around a rock. I don't know. But, uh, yeah. Four bites, one, one pig. Seems like a good bait. Um, definitely looks good. So, you know, I'll throw away that first day I threw it and, and assume that it's a good bait and it catches fish. So, that's that. On to the next. We got, uh, two, three, three more. Two deep diving crankbaits and then that, that deep diving piece of lead. But, uh, pretty excited to try all three of them. All three of them pretty much, uh, clear water, deep clear water. So, I got a couple ideas of where I can take them. We'll check them out. See you next time.